Keystone species play a unique or critical role in an ecosystem, even to the point that if they were removed, the ecosystem would be dramatically different or in some cases even cease to exist. This term, keystone species, has a reference to architecture. This refers to the keystone in an arch, which holds all of the other stones in place, and without, the arch would collapse. This concept of a keystone species was first developed by Robert T. Payne. Robert Payne worked in the tidal plains off of Tatoosh Island in Washington. In this area, Robert Payne systematically removed a species of starfish. He found that with the starfish removed, mussels which had been eaten by the starfish quickly crowded out many other species and took over the habitat and many of its resources. The starfish, like all keystone species, had a disproportionately large impact on the ecosystem, even to the point that they determined the number and type of species and organisms in that ecosystem. He also found that keystone species are often, but not always, a predator. Another example of a keystone species is a sea otter. Otters eat sea urchins and control their population. Without otters, sea urchins overeat the kelp in a habitat. Kelp serves as a very important food and shelter in the ecosystem. And it is used by many species of fish to hide from predators. With otters removed, the ecosystem is dramatically different. Let's look at an example of a keystone species that is an herbivore instead of a predator. Elephants on the African savannas are keystone species. Elephants eat and control the population of trees on the savanna. For example, they knock over and eat small and large acacia trees all over the savanna. This feeding prevents the savanna from becoming a forest or woodlands area. This helps maintain the savannas as a grassland, which feeds many grazing animals like zebras, gazelles, and wildebeest. It also supports many burrowing species like mice and shrews. So again we can see that the elephant is a keystone species because of its disproportionately large impact on the ecosystem to determine the number and type of species and organisms in an ecosystem. Without the elephant or the keystone species, this ecosystem would be dramatically different.